Greetings, Benjamin J. from Ben's Trains with another in the series. Well, what you're looking at, of course, is the late Marks plastic caboose. And this was uh, some of the last stuff that Marks made before they went out of business. It's really basic. It's really, really cheap. A plastic body and uh, two axles. Anyway, the problem with them, of course, is that uh, there is no rear coupler. So you can't use it as rolling stock. Until now. So I found a really easy, simple way to add a rear coupler to these plastic cabooses. So all I did was took a uh, paint stirrer, as you see, and uh, cut it to width, and then used a grinder to cut out clearance for the two wheels. As you see, epoxied it in place, drilled a hole in it, put a paper joiner through it, and it's up and running with a rear coupler. And the nice thing about this, of course, is now you can use it as rolling stock, where before you could not. So as you see, it works. It's really simple to do it. It only takes a couple of minutes and it gives you a piece of rolling stock that you didn't have before. Works absolutely perfectly. So a couple of drops of epoxy, epoxy that uh, little block of wood in there, and I have a new piece of rolling stock. Really simple to do this. Only, literally, only takes a few minutes. And uh, just took a uh, spare coupler that I had. And as you see, just uh, slide that piece of wood in there, epoxy it in place, and attach the coupler directly to it where the front one is mounted on a stanchion. This is also a great way to repair a locomotive or a uh, caboose that uh, has the stanchion broken off. So it's a really simple repair, really basic and crude in this case. It only took a couple of minutes to make it. The thing is it works. It works actually quite well. And you could actually put a wood screw here or a sheet metal screw uh, to hold that uh, coupler on. I used a paper joiner simply because I have paper joiners and it works. So as you see, a really simple way to add a rear coupler to the plastic Marks caboose. And like I said, it gives you a new piece of rolling stock because now you have a uh, coupler on either end. So straightforward, simple. Best of all, of course, is the fact that it works. So just a quick video. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to drop an email, benstrains at gmail.com. And as always, thank you for watching.